All right. Let's see what's going oh, okay. on here, girl. Yo. What do you got? What don't we got? Women and men of your dreams. Synaptic acting A-listers. No washed up virtue porn boy toys or blow up dolls here. Oh, tur stuff. Huh? It'll grip your heart and blow your nerves right out of your body. Pure bit-based ecstasy. That's why people come here. Clearly know how to sell it. Okay. Not a sales pitch. It's a warning. I'll give you one word. Bespoke. Not for everyone's synapses. Think you can handle it? Bespoke. Damn, that sounds promising. I get it. I'm in. Mm-hmm. Couple of things you need to know first. <clears throat> Severe penalties for any unauthorized recording. No okay. drugs, no groping. Okay. Someone catch your eye? You do not grab them. You find them in the catalog, ask for a BD, and get yourself a box. I really look that green deal. Like I don't know. Mm -hmm. Dude, what's about Doors to go open. down, boys? Have fun, doll. Welcome to Lizzie's. <laughs> All right. Yo. My, what a sweet little face you have. What up? What are you eating there? Looks delicious. What's really going on in here, lads? Yo, yo. What's going on in here? Hey. Greetings. What's up, bruh? Hey. Get you something. Jeez, look at this guy's eyes. So curious. The name Lizzie's. That the owner? Not for a long while, no. And it's none too sweet a story. Oh, now I'm just flat interested. The real Lizzie ran a strip joint out of this place back in the day. Lizzie's bar. The girls were paid right, insured, even had decent security. Good spot, all in all. Let me guess. It didn't last. No. Tiger Claws took care of that. Tiger beat one of Lizzie's girls real bad ones. No hesitation, Lizzie blasted the guy's balls off. Huh. Gang came back the next day. Liz was done. Tigers gave this place up to the Mox in the end, though, didn't they? Sort of. The Moxes had to make a deal with them. Luckily, they kept their heads organized quick. Big boss now is Susie Q. But the sign stayed up, out of respect. And biz booms to this day. Interesting. What's on the menu? What's up? Oh, a bunch of booze. Okay. All right. We're good. Uh, okay. Looking for Evelyn Parker. Know if she's here? Who's asking? A big tipper. Generous when I get the answers I'm looking for. Appreciate the gesture. Truly. But afraid I don't get paid to talk. Opposite, actually. It's all right, Mateo. I was waiting for this one. Oh, hello. What up? Evelyn Parker. I knew it was you as soon as you walked in. Heck yeah, give me a nice drink. Ah, uh, yes. Sense on. Only tequila I drink. <laughs> How would you know? I like to know everything about the people I work with. Either that or it was just a lucky guess. Why we meet in here? Any particular reason? Actually, it doesn't seem much like your thing, this place. Mm hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I'll take that as a compliment. Come on. No place we can talk where ears won't prick up to listen. We'll be in the lounge, Mateo. Anyone asks, we're not here. Alrighty. So, what can a horny girl like me do for a hungry guy like you? Whoa. A little vanilla and sprinkles? Or kinkier? Wax? Maybe electrosex? Zappies? 
car implants? Hmm? Hmm? Here's what I want. You and your girlfriend wearing high heels, blindfolds, and big gigs. Hmm, no problem. You buying or renting? Renting? How much? Relax. It'll go on your tab. Think I got just the thing for you, too. <laughs> You're about to get ripped off, brother. This one's me and candies. You'll feel us everywhere. It's fun. Oh, so, see you on the other Not side, the baby. Really? Yo, Why what's going on in here? I just told you. Dex had a load to say about you. Called you professional, effective, and trustworthy. I hope he wasn't overselling. Uh... You don't give a rat's dick what Dex thinks. We both know that. You have trouble accepting compliments? No, just think flattery's beneath you. Am I wrong? Dex is beneath you. Have you known each other long? You write in Dex's bio? Hate to disappoint, but I just don't know much. In other words, you hardly know each other. Yet he fingered you for this job. Hmm. Curious. Interesting choice of words. <laughs> Shit, buzz Dex right now if you're getting cold feet. I can wait. I doubt he'd add anything I haven't already heard. Anything I'd really like to hear for that matter. There's only one other bunch that's worse than fixers in that respect. Used car salesmen. <laughs> I'll go with my gut for now. Let's cut to the chase. What do you got for me? Your target. I trust you know what it is. Relic, secure your soul trinket. Key tech in the program, actually. We're tangling with Arasaka. Making this heist one dangerous, risky motherfucker. Arasaka? Mm -hmm. Arasaka's poured billions into personality transfer technology. But me, I just want the data on this one. The chip is tucked away inside Compeki Plaza, the hotel. You ever been? You know, just never rolled through that neighborhood. Damn shame. The fresh they serve is sinfully good. Chef must have made a deal with the devil. So where's this chip hiding, exactly? In a suite on the top floor. The room's occupied by Yorinobu Arasaka. Yorinobu Arasaka? He's in town? Don't you read the scream sheets? The media couldn't get enough of Yori coming to Night City. It was all over the headlines. Anyway, he's heir apparent to the Arasaka Empire. Saburo Arasaka's only surviving son. What, so well, Arasaka Jr. is planning to grab the reins while in Night City? Only a handful of people in Night City know what the Arasaka's real plans are. Telling me you're one of them? So we're not jumping the corp. We're jumping Yorinobu Arasaka himself. <sighs> Yorinobu is a puppet. He lost all his cards years ago when he failed to do daddy's bidding. Saburo's had Yuri's balls in a vice for years. He might just turn the screw and crush them outright if he learns his son's up to no good again. Look, if you've got any spare aces up your sleeve, now's the time to show them. Now this should make your tits perk up. Yorinobu recently swiped the chip from an Arasaka laboratory. He's made a deal with Netwatch, aims to sell it to them. Hmm. Have you spotted my ace yet, or do I need to spell things out? Fine. So no Arasaka security on the device, because Yorinobu whisked it away in secret. Now where's he hiding it? Well, likely in a specialized container. One that mimics an organic neural environment. On the outside, it looks like an ordinary briefcase. And the case is? You'll see for yourself soon enough. Provided we're done gossiping about the Arasakas. One more thing. 
Data that's on the chip. What is it? Irrelevant, entirely. We're talking about data Yorinobu snuck out of Arasaka. What's more, he wants to pass it on to Netwatch. Sounds pretty damn relevant to me. Listen, V. The relic. That's my concern. Your concern? Earning a paycheck. Just get the job done. I'll make sure your bank accounts are sated. I don't know, bruh. Okay. What's next? Now comes the best part. Follow me. Got something for you. Should help you plan. Brain dance from Compeki Plaza. How's a brain dance supposed to help? Need facts, not thrills. <laughs> Think BDs are only good for fondling virtual tits? Jacking off to in those boxes? No. It can be a very useful tool. Uh -huh. Good for like analyzing uh -huh. details, Ew. human Twilight. perception, even boosted, doesn't grasp. Black. Exactly what you need. So what's on the tape? Yorinobu's suite. The glorious interior. The heck? You'll need to locate the relic yourself. Zombie apocalypse? Hope I grabbed enough detail to make that possible. And yeah, we're getting the VIP tour here, boys. Yo, what up, ladies? What's going on over here? What's hmm? fine here? Hold up. You mean to say you recorded this? Mm-hmm. BD rec implant. Why, you object? It's supposed to be Yorinobu's pad on the tape. Means you were inside. You, uh, know each other? How else could I get all this intel? I know him pretty well, actually. Oh, we have boy. an arrangement. Strictly business. Suits us both, I think. Let's see this brain dance. Oh, Judy things are help. getting more and more complicated. She's a mosh, too. Besides, we go back, uh, years. V, this is important. Judy's always been there for me. Always helped out. I trust her. But she's a mox, not the latest member of your crew. Try not to forget. So you'll be a good girl, tread lightly, and keep that tongue on a leash. Relax. Jeez, Believe it or not, I'm no stranger to act. In biz or life. Yo. <clears throat> hey, there you are. This is V. She's here for that BD role. And V, this is Judy. Best brain dance editor I know. Enough already. You're gonna make me barf. Sensory SIG amps. Acoustic and emotive wave monitors. Oh, top shelf hardware. Yeah, most of it's customized. Only thing factory are the casings. <laughs> Mod all this yourself? What do you think? Expression translator. Fuyutsuki, right? Thought the matrices on that series were fucked up. They were, but swapping out matrices is simple. And this was the only model that'd support additional scanware. <clears throat> all right, all right. Compiled your BDF. What do you think? Will it do? Still pretty raw, but yeah, ought to do. Mm-hmm. V needs to get deep inside. That's most important. So, let's calibrate. Tune it to her. Believe me, I've dealt with worse. Should see the jig-jig street porn we gotta contend with sometimes. So, we drop V inside? Let her look, let her rummage around, right? How about it, V? Raw brain dance. Ever taken a dip before? What do you mean by raw? How's this differ from the ready-mades? Huh. Ready-mades, provided they're well-made, should feed you feelings and impressions you'd never have the chance to experience yourself in real space. But it's mass market shit, so it's pre-crafted, hard-coded, fenced in, and manageable. A raw one? Well... It's more like a virtue in Viro. Get to move around, look at things in detail. Editors use those layers to fish for juicier emotes and impulses, then use them to pad the BDs that go to market. Sit down, settle in, and we'll get you going. Oh boy, more brain damage, Bush. Let's do it. Time to become an Omega Cyborg.
gotta create your sensory profile first. A what profile now? A model of your perceptions and emotional responses. Need to adjust that so the raw BD won't overwhelm you. If I don't, best case scenario, you'll get nauseous as soon as you're in. Probably barf like you would in a shoddy virtue enviro. Mm-hmm. And worst case? Your synapses sizzle like locusts in a deep fryer. But we're not about to let that happen. Nah. -uh. Okay, hit All right. right. Just promise me it won't hurt. It won't. Not this time. Now sit still. Look at me. Gonna run the analysis soft. Should feel a slight tingling. Mm-hmm. Okay, now let's set the optics and other sensory sigs. Look smack into these two screens. Pretend it's an eye exam. Am I gonna have to do this calibration dance every time? Not necessarily, but it's worth the wait. Give me two more minutes and you'll see exactly what BD analysis is capable of. One more sec. Need to get the pain receptor limiters in. Pain receptors? Okay. Oh, Lord. All set. I need to test your profile first. Tossing in a sample BD. You can use it to get to know the editor. Now, let me see. Where could we... Can't you just use my recording? Why are we wasting time? So we don't risk our necks? Sides won't take a sec. Got something here. Should be perfect. Boot it up. Mm-hmm. Let me give you the tailored version first. Let you get your bearings. Then we'll jump into editing mode. Be diving in in three, two, one. And we're dead. <laughs> Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on you go. Okay. Down, everybody! On the ground! I wanna see you kissing the flooring! Muddy! Now, or I will fucking drop hey, you! I swear bro. to God! Whoa! Yeah! Hey! Uh, uh, now! Before I blow your fucking head off! Ah. Ah. And we shot him and took the money, huh? Slow, deep breaths. Your cortisol and adrenaline spiked, but the soft activated your hormone blockers. Nothing happened. You're alive and well. A flash of intense shock. second could have warned me how much it hurts to die trust me real death hurts much much more not so sure about that you'll be fine got everything set up let's switch over to editing mode okay so i watch other people's memories i'll sever the link to the bd roller's sensory array you'll be able to look around freely whole scene's yours Full cam control in brain dance and editing mode, you can move the so camera move around, freely. Zoom in and out, whatever else you come up with. Think of it as your own little sandbox. So, analysis mode, you control playback. Can even pause when you feel the need. Then you use the editor console to unpause. Try it. Plan simple. Do nothing up. But don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. Dream as hell, right? Well, that's not all. You can speed things up or rewind, whatever you like. Give it a try. Personal key to rewind, rewind. a brain Roll it dance? Back to the top. All good, neat. Now try fast forwarding a bit. Fast forward. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Okay. You can also reset the recording. That'll take you right back to the beginning. Try it. Now for some fun. This here's why you came in the first place. 
Okay. In analysis mode, you get to view and even scan details of the enviro recorded by the BD roller. Focus on the heat, the gun this gonk gets from his buddy at the beginning. Now scan it. You can only scan a clue during moments when it's perceivable by the person recording the brain dance. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on you go. Okay, right here. Indicates currently selected layer. Visual layer, thermal layer, sound layer. Old sections on the track indicate a scannable clue. The clue will be highlighted for the duration of the sequence and the editor is set to the correct layer. Clues may overlap each other. The spot where they overlap on the recording track will be especially bright. After being switched to... Okay, so... Okay. Excellent. Let's move on. Now, heads up. In analysis mode, you can ferret out background noise and conversations if the roller got close enough. This tech records everything, every little detail, even the sights and sounds the roller was never aware of. To see the sources of the recorded sensory signals, switch to the audio layer in the editor. Go ahead and try that now. Okay, good. Now you should see several sound signatures in the store. Choose one and hone in on it. Okay, fuck! On you ah, little shitheads! Go restock, I'll take the register. How about you suck a bag of dicks, eh? So, any thoughts? Unbelievable. Seriously, like it was happening right next to me. Yeah, it's how BD recording implants work. They pick up everything, all the elements in the background. Then an editor tweaks them, makes them pop. Keep playing with the sound, explore it a bit. We'll move on when you get bored. Hmm. Sometimes you can analyze extra layers in the raw, stuff the roller's cyberware picked up. Like what? Ev's got Kiroshi optics that grab infrared, meaning you should be able to grab heat signatures from her recording. Huh, hella nice. Now, let's wait till the guy punches out the gonk at the counter. Yeah, everybody, up. Up. Scanning works on peeps, too. Walk up to the wounded chick. Try scanning her. Alright, next thing. Scroll forward to the part where our artist gets a lead injection. Now, or I will fucking drop you! I swear to God! Look, 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 look. See that? They shot him, and he never saw it coming. But you will. Here it comes. Oh, we got My shot in the part of the game. from the front. See the blinking thing over the entrance? Surveillance cam. Must have caught our shooter. You'll see in a sec. Cam feeds to the screen behind the clerk. Roll back to where the screen's in the kid's field of vision. Then scan it. His own chumba shot him. Wait a Probably second, that doesn't make along. sense. Must have got a nice slice of cred on the black market for a BD like this. He BD got shot from out here. Because the blood was going line. back. Anyway, if you've seen enough, you can exit. He got shot in the back, not in the front. Oh, he's right there. Ah, okay. He got shot in the side of the head. I knew it was his own buddy. Killed him, took the money. It's messed up. I done called that. Yeah, it's impressive, right? It's too bad most of the BDs we do here are only good for flogging the log. Anyway, you ready to do this? Look at your wreck? I don't know. I... Ugh, let's take a break. Still feel like that kid when... <sighs> yeah. Think I'm done. V, there's no time. 
Get it together, please. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. Just need T-Buck to link in. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Who? Runner for my crew. Security specialist. She'll tell me what to look for while we analyze. No problem, I hope. Actually, it is a problem. Not what we agreed, Ev. Evelyn? I won't get a damn thing out of this without T-Bug. Judy, please. Ev, she wants to bring a runner in? What part of that don't you understand? How do I know she'll only perch in this footage, observe, not fuck with anything? Me. I'm your guarantee. Yeah, right. Help me. This one last time. I promise everything will work out, just like we planned. Okay, V. Call T-Bug and we'll dive in. All right. Let's see what happens. Hey, V. What's happening? Bug, listen. I got some useful footage from Konpeki Plaza. It's a brain dance. Konpeki? Oh, thought as much. Someone there with you? Unimportant, Bug. Please, focus. Need your help. Got no clue what I'm supposed to look for once I'm in. Alright, see if I can walk you through it. Jacking into your tech now. Mm, you've got to give me access. Opening port 1779. Secure protocol? Good, I'm going in. Should be getting my request... now. Got it. You ready? I'm Millisec. Okay. Connection confirmed. Now some quick tip ice, and we're clear. Ready to dance. Fire her up, Judy. All right. What the heck's about to happen in this one? Just whiteness. Uh oh. Don't tell me it's bugged out. All right, V. Eyes open. Gotta find out where Yurinobu's keeping the relic. Scan the apartment security systems. Watch the whole recording from everyone's point of view. Whoa! You look like a cut of fuckable meat, are you? Evelyn. She. Holy hell! I felt her fear. Sure got it under control quick too. I said no. This ya. Oh, there's something back here I can scan. Or not? Ah, yes. Military grade cyberware detected. 96% cybernetic. Dude, this guy is crazy, bro. Okay. What else can I scan here? Alarm firmware's fresh, but saw excited birds chirping on a BBS. Something about lots of seeds falling to this sieve. Let me generate keys. I can forge their six. Nice. Shit, camera's packed with new tech. Motion sensors, heat sig activators, IFF. You skilled enough to kill it all? Mucho more than enough. Just need access to their subnet. I said no. They'll have my head for this. Then you shall pack. Bada bada bada. I was scan this. For good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. Here in a drone, ventilation and cooling. Servers. Gotta be. Fancy doodads in here need to be controlled. I need a minute. Listen in on that conversation, V. Could be something important. Finish. I need a minute. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. Please speak with your father. 
He's taken a particular interest in this project. He can certainly explain the risks. My father's a tired, visionless old greybeard who thinks nothing will change and he'll live forever in his tiny frozen bubble. I should not even be listening to such things. You will listen to this. Saburo is an adult despot, utterly removed from reality. Stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists. Of a world that may never have existed. We have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. I am quite sure we want now. Read the documentation carefully. The relic requires specific storage conditions. You must no, provide them. In Heard that? Relic docks gotta be around here somewhere. Look for them. Oh. Okay. Sorry to make you wait. Business can be stupid. Hmm. It wasn't long. Not even long enough for me to grow bored. Is everything all right? You seem tense, edgy. A moment, it will pass. <sighs> I can get to work on that. Just one condition. You wish to make demands of me. Only one. Focus on me. Oh, God. Something I gotta scan in here. What is it? Oh, I'm on the wrong scanner. Whoops. We left. Uh. I don't see what I'm supposed to be scanning here. Oh. Automated turret. Oh, boy. Automated turrets. Latest scanner model. System is all connected to the server. Can you shut them off? Externally, no way. Gotta get in, check out how they link into the system first. Mm-hmm. Looks like all their security systems are linked to the hotel subnet. We need the flathead. No other way to shut down these systems. Can't get around them ourselves? Nope. At least I'm fresh out of ideas. Stuff was pretty fun last time. Bedroom. Nightstand. I've got an idea. Be right back. Very nice. But come here already. Just a sec. Looking for the perfect thing. Ah, oh, you'll like this. What is that that he just put down there, Beth? Manual details a special tip controlled container. Relic needs to be kept real cool. So, Chip's gotta stay in the freezer. Yep, could damage it otherwise. Okay, switch on thermal layer detection in the editor. Wait, there's a gun Should there. Should be easier to spot where your Nobu's keeping the chip. The thermal layer is now unlocked. Bro, but there's a guy. Here we go. Loaded. Safety's on. Good to know, though. Once you're in there, don't forget about that iron. Oh, yes, yes. Whoa, what the, Davy Jones? I don't think there's anything there for me to see. Oh, fuck. It, it's like I'm really... V? Eye on the prize. Focus. Warui Kome. I miss this. You. I know. Gosh, dang it. No, I'm just kidding. Why not? Wait, sit down. And give up. So now we gotta find a thermal thing with the thermal. Oh. Something here that I can scan. The wall, maybe? Ah, uh, yeah. Air conditioning, standard model for hotels of this caliber. Tip matches that stipulated in the docks, but no way the chip's hiding there. Too risky. Temp fluctuations, risk of damage. 
Okay, we gotta go further back. Angie, I'm off. Oh, Donna Geese. Looks like Mr. Arasaka had something to celebrate. Really think you'll find the chip in there? No way. Tim's too low. Could fluctuate. Nice try, though. How far backwards we go? Oh, far. oh, maybe the big dude had it. Whoop. What do I need to scan over here? Just a fancy ass fridge. Tip doesn't match the guidelines. Won't find a thing here. Further back we go. Well, trial phase. We cannot take it to what can we scan here? Ah, I see. Right, grab the heat sig, matches the spec in the docks. Your nobu's got the case here, guaranteed. Mm -hmm. It's in the we floor. Good work. Looks like we got everything we need. Quit out of the editor. Earn a voice. Or an indeed, lads. We done solved the case.